Welcome to Safety Tips on Talking Beyond. On reading last week in the newspaper, the women in Bangalore feel very unsafe. And I'm sure all the women all over the world in India are really concerned about safety. We have talked about some good safety tips in Talking Beyond in the previous episodes. I hope viewers, you would listen and uh, follow some of those tips. So Vishal here has some really good products which we can carry with us to uh, protect ourselves in an emergency. Vishal. Hi. So actually uh, we have been reading a lot of news regarding the safety issue for women and uh, nowadays you can say even men are also under threat and they face different kinds of crimes also. So can you explain how, uh, like if I'm uh, going to the railway station and I'm standing there and I'm, um, you know, I'm attacked by somebody, what can I do? See, uh, first of all, uh, you always have to be aware of the situation. I mean, of the surrounding. Be alert, yeah. yeah. So that uh, uh, if you are traveling, if you are going in a, on a way, then you should not be on the phone and all. Right, right. So That's a is, definite. Yeah, it's no. very important. Otherwise, you will be more prone to get attacked. Yeah. So uh, we have here few self-defense products, which will be very useful in kind of emergency situation. So we have three kinds of pepper sprays here. As you know, like these pepper sprays are uh, the most popular self-defense products because it is very easy to use and it is very effective. So, in uh, one shot, you can handle multiple attackers. This is advanced pepper spray, so which is the uh, uh, first product from X Boom, and uh, it has a range of seven feet. It is very easy to use, as well as it has a safety cap. It's called flip flop safety cap. So you can just uh, aim it to your attacker, and the spray will go for seven feet and it will be effective for 30 to 45 minutes. This is for that and these again two are the different models. This is lipstick pepper spray 1, this is lipstick pepper spray 2. Right. So these are again in a kind of blingy design so that it acts as a disguise and nobody will be able to understand that what it actually is. Yeah. Right. Like if you are in the railway station and in the uh, toilet yeah. and somebody tries, uh, a woman also can attack you and then you can use one of these because this is a closer distance yes, event, right? Yes. And um, so, again, this one is interesting. Yeah, so this is a blink. It's a two-in-one uh, cell defense tool. It is a torch and uh, it's a stop. <laughs> so <laughs> you just have to made in contact with your attacker. Yeah. And uh, then your attacker will be paralyzed for two to three months. Oh, they will? Yes. Wow. Okay. So you will get... Uh, That's a nice one, you know. yeah. Yes. This is a kitty keychain. Yeah, right. this is good. So this is very handy. You can attach it to your keychain or probably to your bag. And you can put this uh, curly whirly plastic on it. And so that way it's hanging on your handbag. It's hanging on your handbag right here. And then you can just kind of go like this and just... You know, it's, it's not away from your bag. So you still have the bag and you still attack somebody. Yes. I love this one. Definitely need to get that. I think everybody needs one. And it looks cute too. And uh, what is the other thing you were telling me about? Uh, we have two devices here. Okay. So this is a panic alarm. Right. Okay. So this work is a, it works as a two, uh, two way. You know, first thing is it acts as a panic alarm. Like suppose if you are under any threat, and you can do it. So, especially in the closed area, yeah. something like that, yeah. that will be very useful. And you could put it, uh, yeah. see, it? So. see, you could put it on your handbag too, like this, if you want, and keep it, uh, keep it inside or whatever, and that way it's handy. And then uh, also your luggage, you could, if you're sleeping, you can tie it to your bag, and if somebody's trying to take your bag, they won't know that they pull it. It goes off. Exactly. That's excellent. Yeah. And the other one? Uh, the other one is uh, asset tracker. So this is a tracker, GPS tracker device, okay. which you can keep it in your bag. And uh, just switch on this device, keep it on. 
like it has different kind of modes yeah. you're putting it in the uh, lesser like what happens like for the light tracking the battery yeah. will be one thing okay. but uh, if you are putting it in the uh, like it will send the alerts after one minute of interval okay. then it will be like for three okay. days and nobody will expect to see this device you know and they they won't uh, suspect there's something when they take a suitcase or a handbag or a briefcase so i think it's a great device to for your laptop and everything you know? and then i love this one which will paralyze the person for a few minutes so i can take care of myself and it's a torch light too so this is perfect but today my safety tips is about um, uh traveling on the metro which is a new thing for us in india and so there's a lot of excitement about it but also we need to always be alert wherever you are you need to be alert keep your handbag zipped up and close to your body if you are carrying a backpack make sure you put it in the front not at the back make sure a lot of people you stand with them so you're not targeted you know and also dress appropriately it's very important not to attract attention to yourself don't carry expensive bags like this in the train because it uh, asks for attention so be uh, try to merge with the surroundings wear clothes which are covered don't wear too many open things uh, and don't um, uh, you know uh, strike a conversation with a stranger just like that you know just keep keep to yourself this, these are all tips for when you're traveling alone and there are a lot of people getting into the metro getting out so be aware be alert don't take any non um, you know drowsy um, allergy tabs or anything where you're feeling a little drowsy and sleepy and you won't know what's happening somebody take something from you and if when you get a seat you just sit upright don't look at the neighbors don't create any eye contact with any men and uh, for young girls especially older women try not to wear too much jewelry because it's not a good idea you don't want to get killed for a small diamond ring or a earring or something like that it's not worth it so just wear fake jewelry when you're traveling taking public transport metro railways and be alert everywhere you go there's always um, uh, police around i heard our metro has lots of bangalore metro has lots of uh, um, police on the station and in the metro so just uh, go to them if you need any help other safety thing is don't get off the train um, like if it's not your final destination don't get off in these little stops because it might just leave you behind and go and some of them are very deserted you know and even the vendors cannot be trusted so you have to be very careful and be um, you know cautious and if you are a woman traveling alone don't take the first class coupe because that has a door and you are might be stuck with three people you don't know and they could just lock the door and do something to you but just be alert be smart be safe we we all should be safe we shouldn't be afraid to travel because we are all humans we should help each other and we should care so let's all be smart and not stupid and be alert wherever we go it's been a pleasure vishal having you on our show and giving us all this information and to get more information on the products please contact www.xboom.in for more information on these products you can always log on to www.xboom.in where you can where you can find out our latest uh, devices devices okay. and uh, in the details about the products yeah. thank you be safe till next time